Hello and welcome to Optics Rate YouTube channel. My name is Spela and today I will review Steiner Safari Ultra Sharp 8x20 binoculars. Steiner is still one of the most popular companies that offers premium optics praised by many sportsmen, hunters, explorers and law enforcement around the world. One of the reasons is that Steiner works using only the best materials, production techniques and testing. This is the smallest model in Steiner Safari Ultra Sharp series. Binoculars feature Schmidt Beham roof prism that allow for a more compact binocular shape. Then you also have the really small 22mm objective lenses that keep the overall dimension of the body to a minimum. They use double hinge body design, which enables them to fall down into a very small compact shape allowing you to store them in just about any jacket or even a shirt pocket when not in use. Binoculars are around 10 cm long and 11 cm wide when extended or 8 cm wide when folded. These design features make these the ideal binoculars for just about any hiker, backpacker, outdoor sport enthusiast, and are a perfect co companion on a birding holiday or walking safari. Design of these binoculars is, I would say, unique, because almost the whole surface is designed to provide a better grip. You can see that here, 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 and also on the other side, here. Binoculars have two colors dark brown and black. And you can also see some of the details. Here is the name of the manufacturer and the name of the series. The housing is made out of a durable polycarbonate and rubber, and that is why the binoculars are extremely light. They weigh 240 grams. They are also filled with nitrogen gas, to ensure that the device is both 100% water and fog proof. Focusing wheel is very small and positioned at the center of the binoculars. The surface is, is designed to provide a better grip and the focusing mechanism is fast, which is suitable for bird, watcher, bird watching because you can easily focus on fast moving objects. These binoculars don't have multi-positional twist-up eye cups, as many other binoculars, but they have foldable eye cups. So, users without eyeglasses have to adjust the eye cups in a non-folded position, like this. But if you wear eyeglasses, make sure that the eye cups are folded down, like this. On the right ocular, there is also a ring for diopter adjustment and also with a good grip. Let's see what's included in the box. With binoculars, you also get this soft case, which is really nice. You also get a cleaning cloth and instructions with 10 years warranty. So, let's see some good points. For the 8x magnification compact binoculars, these have a nice wide field of view, 115 meters, which is important as it helps make it much easier for you to quickly locate and then follow any fast moving action. At 3 meters, the minimum focus distance is close enough should you also like to occasionally observe things like butterflies or birds on a nearby feeder. Their small size and the fact that with a double hinge design, you can position the eye cups very close together also makes these binoculars perfect for an older child or teenager with smaller hands and close-set eyes. 
They feature advanced UV coatings and high contrast lenses, so there is no internal reflections. There is also no tint, the build quality is really good, price is affordable, 129 euros, and you get 10 years warranty, so the service um, and support of the manufacturer is really good. However, it is important to keep in mind that the, the downside to having such small lenses is that, like the small windows in your house, they capture and let in far less light than binoculars with larger lenses. Well, this is fine when there is a plenty of available light during the day, but it does mean that they are far less capable in low light situations. The eye cups are uncomfortable, I think that due to the fact that they are foldable. Binoculars also have short eye relief, so they are not suitable for the eyeglass viewers. Image around edges is also not sharp and clear enough. And what is really bad is that there is no eye cups or objective lens covers in the box. And also there is a fishbowl effect. But considering the low price, these binoculars give satisfying results. Thank you for watching. If you have any question, please leave a comment down below, like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and see you next time. Bye!